Governor Adam Sushumale said President Kulok Jonathan has made history as the first sitting president to concede defeat in an election adjudged to be free and fair in Nigeria. The governor said with his action, President Jonathan has shown that the interest of a country supersedes his interest and ambition. We should appreciate the president, the city president, for conceding defeat in the manner that he did. Again, he will go down in history as the first Nigeria city president to concede a defeat even before the full result is announced. The sort of thing we see in the advanced world. So slowly and steadily, we can see consistent improvement in our in the democratic process. Others who commented at the airport, including the deputy governor, Dr. Pius Dubu, said development shows that the nation's democracy has come of age. I will resort to the immortal words of Martin Luther King Jr. when he said, free at last, free at last, thank God Almighty, free at last. It is very clear now that once you get yourself into the shoes of power and you, and you ensconce yourself in the arms of Morpheus and you decide to become an, a political emir of Transjordan at the expense of the oil polloi, the rag tag and the bobtail, or at the expense of Aminu Kanu Stalakawa, you will know that when you face the people, political seppuku shall be your portion. The, ele the result of the election met the aspiration of all Nigerians. With the outcome of, of the March 29th election, I have renewed confidence that Nigeria time has come. Party faithful and supporters gathered at the airport all through Wednesday to receive Governor Adam Sushomole, who was returning from Abuja, where he joined other APC chieftains to accompany the president-elect, General Muhammad Buhari, retired to receive his certificate of return from INEC. Christy McCauley, reporting.